Hello everybody and welcome back to Spirit of the Island where we just built our first animal barn but I don't have enough money to put an animal in it yet so that's what we're going to work on a little bit today I feel um, I'm also going to carry on trying to sort of make some some little areas uh, I'll make another area maybe for the lambs to go in obviously we've got the farm up here oh the farm's got loads of cool stuff got a big old harvest and that might help quite a lot actually with getting the money together for the cow so maybe that is what we will work on first in this episode and then we'll go down to the pier okay apparently my bag is too full for carrots uh what have we got in there that shouldn't be Quite a few seeds. I've got another 48 coffee. Last time I had 48 coffee. Oh, you know what I still haven't done? Is gotten any more plastic bottles. I think I can make plastic bottles, can't I? I'm sure I can make them on the workbench. Give me a second. So that will make it so much easier. If I can. Yeah. I need duct tape, resin and firewood. Okay. That will make coffee so much easier to make if I have a, like more than four bottles. It was horrendous last time. I'm not, not going through that again. Maybe like two or three trips. Don't mind if I maybe got like, I don't know, ten bottles and I have to do four trips or something. Come on, duct tape. I know I've asked for a lot of you, but um, you're being very slow. I should probably have done five on each bench. I am a very silly she lab sometimes, I swear. Oh, I'm nearly done, but that's better than going back and forth and back and forth with the bottles like I had to last time. Right. Not being a silly she lab this time. So I'll have 14 bottles. That'll be 14, yeah, about four trips with the coffee then. That's not as bad. I really could maybe do with um, extending this area out and putting kitchen stuff in it or something, or maybe making another area for a, a ki an outdoor kitchen. I feel like I spend a lot of time waiting around for cooking stuff to happen. Would help if I actually fill the bottles up, wouldn't it? Yes, it would. So I've got 12 empty bottles, two full ones. Seven for the empty ones. Right, so now I can make the coffee 14 at a time, which is a lot better. Oh no, I can't because I don't have enough firewood. Okay, so how about while I get some salads on the go, as many as I can, five of them, I go and make some firewood because we'll need a total of 48. I even need to cut a tree down at this rate. Oh my goodness me. Oh, we've got quite a few trees that I really think are surplus to requirement right now. <laughs> so. Let's chop one. Seven wood logs and two apples, that will do. I move a lot of the trees rather than cutting them down and since I've been doing that I've had a lot less to play with. That will do. How are my chickens doing? Are they running low on water? No, they're still going. Like, <laughs> amazing. They go for ages. 
I feel like this is such a cute homestead though. I love it. I really, really love it. Alright, let's see how my salads are doing. They're all done. Do I have wheat that I need to turn into chicken food? This is the next question. I also need to water. I do, I've got 12 wheat, but it's not a desperate situation at the moment. I could find some apples to sort of counterbalance them, that would be great. How my cherries are doing. Oh well. Oh, there's apples on that tree. So if I've got 12, then I need about probably eight apples or something. Leaving that tree alone. The thing is, even if I cut down every tree in my in my place, I'd still have the trees outside. Still not brave enough to work on beehives yet. I'll be that'll be where I die. I'll be like, nah, you're dead now. The bees, they got you. I'm gonna quickly feed myself. I'll wait for those to finish. All right, they're done. Nice. All right, let's start on the coffee. Do those like 12 to 14 at a time. Drank a couple of the waters, so. Don't know how long they take. A little while. I might do a little bit of like road creation maybe human ah, i always lose it where's the road 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 that's trees and plants There we are, basic road. I am silly sometimes. Alright, so that is never gonna work with these trees in the way. So let's uh, see if I can put them somewhere else. Don't worry, I will be properly moving them to a, a proper location very soon. Well, this is definitely nicely, uh, nicely separating things for now, and then I probably will be changing things up a lot eventually. But for now, just a cute little homestead. I actually don't mind that apple tree being in there with the cows. I think it actually kind of looked decorative. But I am going to need to maybe thin them out a bit. Hmm. How the coffee's doing. 100% coffee. Lovely. My bag is full. My bag is full all the time. Every minute of every day, my bag is full. No, I need that. I need that for the coffee. What are you doing? 
I don't need is like random planks, bits of resin. Logs, fat, fiber, resin. Don't need any of that. Oh, I do need the stone though, because I'm only building roads at the moment. Yeah, that'll do. Okay, lovely. Now let's go get the coffee that was uh, spilled on the ground. I don't mind if some seeds go missing, but I'd be a bit upset if my coffee all went missing, because that's quite a lot of it's quite a lot of money's worth, that is. Um I know I won't get quite that much for it, but it'll be about 500. So it'd probably be a good good few hundred. And by the time I've done all 48 of them, that'll probably be a good thousand plus. Need to learn how to make boat fuel as well for my for my adventures. But I, like I say, I think my adventures are probably going to be more end game now, especially now I'm not looking for leather. I'm only going to be looking for troll leather. Just while I wait for that coffee to be done, I'm going to just uh, put some animal feed on as well. Plant fiber. Four is apparently the maximum. That's fine. That one chicken barely needs feeding anyway. Do you? Agsika, the chicken. We still gotta take a minute. I'll put away the chicken feed and then I will... In fact, I'll maybe actually feed the chicken. My singular chicken. As I get more money though, I will put more chickens and things in, definitely. I'm not gonna just like, be like, oh well. I just keep one chicken. I will feed you, and then I will take my bucket, and I will water you, and that way we don't need to do anything for a while. And then I'll check on the coffee, and then I will water the plants. And unfortunately now we are at a point where it's too late for me to go and sell these things, but it's fine. I'm... I'm all right with that. We'll do it tomorrow. Tomorrow is another day. I was nowhere near in the right place to get a, a quad water. You win some, you lose some. Hey, go check on the coffee. Oh, actually go and fill up my waters. Then go check on the coffee. So water the whole field in the time that coffee takes, wow. That's what I'm saying. I might rethink having the cooking inside because the cooking is it's a bit more, a bit less kind of uh, harvest moon, a little bit more kind of dinkum or, or something where it's a, a bit more sort of, uh, what would the word be? A little bit more batch processing. Well done. Time to rain now. 
Time for it to rain. <laughs> Yes, we're not going to be getting any, uh... uh am I out of... Coffee beans? Are we finished? Yes, I am. Nice. So, eight more, and then we are good to go. I could maybe, if I've got... A, yeah, and I do have a bit of firewood left. I can make a couple of fried eggs out of the eggs. And then I'll definitely have enough for at least one cow, which will mean at least a little bit of leather being made. So, I need a metal bucket for milking. Probably the wooden bucket for water. I could always actually put the water in ahead of time. I'll prepare for their arrival. Lovely. And I also need hay. But I think that's only like plant fibre. Um, yeah, here we are. Animal food. Hey. Plant fibre and rope. Can I make a rope? Yes. Lovely. And so then I can make some hay. That's all ready. A 50% for one. Okay, well 50% will last him a little while. Especially if it's only one cow for now. One, It'll be one little calf for now, won't it? Because you always have to buy a chick or a calf or a lamb, a baby animal. But yeah, I think some of these trees need to go. Um, I think I'm quite happy to have the trees remain up here. But I think I'm going to need to carve out a little section for my lambs. I think it'd be nice to have it next to my barn as well. In fact, why can't I have the lambs on this side? Or we'll have the workshop in between. And then have my little lamingtons over here. That would work. So I think what I'm going to actually do here is chop the trees. So I keep moving them and they're just... There's too many. Plenty of places I can get apples. So we will just do some land clearing. I'm so happy. It's looking so nice. You know, like I say, I've gotten so much further with this than I've gotten with anything before. But once I've done the barns, I think that's when we're going to be looking at uh, powering the base with electricity. Go back onto the electronic side of it. Please. bag is full so can I put anything away wood away plant fiber away that's about it bag will probably still be full so what I'll have to do is run up and put all the seeds away my foraging has improved! Hurrah! I'm gonna need a new sword before I go out and do combat, aren't I? Oh man, I'm gonna... Uh, yeah, okay. I need to put all this away because I'm gonna run out of stamina soon and that's not gonna be good. Like I said, I do want to keep all the seeds uh, for each season. Oh, 
I think I did just run out of stamina. I'm just going to grab the things that fell on the ground. And then uh, tomorrow when I got a bit more stamina, I will... Hmm. Now this is but not, not good news, is it? Doesn't line up with the gate very well. So I'm not entirely sure what I'm going to do about that. We'll see. Maybe if I run the road all the way along there, it won't matter too much. But yeah, let's go to bed because I'm so tired. And then the second half of this episode, we'll maybe go to the pier and have a little look at the boat. And I think that would be a good thing to do. I've got, I really do have to sell the as well, so I actually have a lot to do. Maybe, maybe the bicycle will help though. I've got my coffee. I'm gonna put away those potatoes. I've got oh yeah, a little harvest to do, so that's fine. My bag is full again. Surprise, surprise. It's always full. Put the wheat away because I do always keep wheat. Ready to make chicken food out of. Chicken food could go away. I don't need chicken food in my bag. It'll just tempt me to sell it. But I don't want to do. Um, oh yeah, I could cook my eggs. I apparently also have enough stuff for some more small salads. You're always a good seller. I'm quite hungry too. Fried egg, small salad. How many can I make? Just one, is it? One is better than none. Forty-eight coffee should be worth two thousand, but it's probably not going to be worth that much. I also somehow got sugar. Where did we get that from? Hmm. No idea. That didn't go in my imagery. That's irritating. Okay, so let's grab some water for myself. If I need to water the fields again... Pick up some water. Water the fields. If I go from this end backwards... It'll be slightly better. But yeah, the coffee harvest's amazing. It's a bit like blueberries in Stardew Valley or something. Really good. Yeah, I will be particularly happy when I get sprinklers and when I get a fridge. Because a lot of the manual labour that I'm doing at the moment is because... I don't have those things. And we're done. And it'll rain in two minutes, as usual. I'm going to leave the eggs in there for now. They can just um, gather up. Right, so 4.17. Still got a couple of hours before I really want to be 
You're going across the road to sell. I'll eat those salads. I will take a drink. There we are. We're feeling good now. And I will just carry on uh, terraforming a little bit. Getting this area ready for when I finally get enough money together for lambs. Iron ore out of that one. Nice. The extra stone is quite good because it means I can add some more paths in. Alright, so next thing. Put some basic road in. Or not. That will do. Let's move off of there. Basic road. And then let's put in a grey sidewalk there. So that area doesn't look as dumb. No, looks a bit silly otherwise. Hmm, looks like I need my sword, my trusty sword. To be fair, it's quite good. The sword has lasted for absolutely ages. Quite pleased with that. Yeah, actually by making that a square, it doesn't look as silly, does it? Okay, so I kind of want to get rid of that rock as well and anything that's in the way of the path. and put away some of this I know I will try to grab some of this stuff but my bag is probably still going to be quite full I'll put away all the seeds and then I'll come and grab the rest of it am I right in thinking I already watered the crops I think I did sugar goes off so I'm just gonna put it in there eventually I might be able to do something with it I don't know so yeah eventually that will be where my lambs go to to live be lovely little baby lambs that'd be so cute there I think that's quite nice um, and then I could utilize the space down here if I want to, but I could well probably just leave it for trees and stuff. Yeah, I'm quite liking this. I think it looks very nice. I think it's also time to get on my bicycle. Where my bicycle's gone. Oh, there it is. Right in front of me. <laughs> Get on my bicycle. And head into town. You feel it slowing as it goes up the hill. It's pretty cool. Try to avoid all those street lights at the back of the bridge. Oops. Didn't quite get that one right, did I? Okay, so apparently thorns don't hurt me when I'm on a bicycle. That's good to know. I don't know whether that's intentional. John! Look out!
I will eventually actually start doing quests and like talking to the village folk. <laughs> Other than Jordan. But at the moment I'm I'm busy on my own little errands, so Hello. I could have a chat though. The island I came from is now controlled by pirates. I don't know if I ever want to go back there. Uh, I'm sorry, it must be a horrible situation. Are all pirates bad? Yes, no doubt. I hope they don't come here. Pirates are the worst kind of people. They do seem pretty mean, don't they? Potatoes. Mm -hmm. All the coffee. Coffee's awesome. That's all I'm going to sell for now. Or maybe two of these actually as well, just so that I don't end up with more than I can eat. So I've got 2017 now, which is enough for maybe two cows. Or... Da, 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 da. I think it's enough for me to make a lamb barn, one lamb, and one cow. So it depends on what I want to do really with, with all of that, uh, all of that dough. Head on back. I don't try to decide what I want to do, whether I want to Whoa! Whoa, that wasn't that wasn't what we wanted to do at all. There's loads of quests on the board, and I'm like, I'm making more money doing stuff my own way. It's like it's like the lampposts actually have magnets on them. And if there's a way that I can bump into something, and I'm fine as long as I'm going in a pretty much a straight line, I'm all right. As soon as I bump into something and have to sort of like three point turn my way out of it, that's why I know it all goes wrong. Hmm. I am still glad to have the bicycle though, because it is still. Even with the bumps and lumps and sort of having to sometimes mess around with things. It, when you get it right, like I did just there. Oops. Oh, that. Ah. When you do get it right, you go quite fast, which is quite nice. Okay, so now, next thing I want to do is to head down to the pier and go and check it out because... Because it's cool. Right, so... Before I do that though, I want to get rid of all this rubbish in my inventory that shouldn't be in here. So most of it is like stone and resin and all that sort of thing. Some full bottles, some empty bottles. I'll put away those two broccoli seeds as well. And then we're going to go and check out the boat. Oh, actually no we're not. You know what we're going to do first? We're going to get our cow. All ready for them. So, B, animals, cup. Hi! What's your name? You're so cute. What's your name? What's your name? You are called. Oh, details. Beerped. Ah, so I actually can rename the animals. Well, next episode I'll bring up my patron list and we will do a little rename of these guys. I just had to click on them. I didn't realize that. Oh well, <laughs> it's been like that for a little while. Um, I'm only now in the financial position to get more animals anyway, so. Okay, so next. I'm gonna turn on my speedy speedy boost and we are gonna go and check out the boat and the pier and everything well, I'm very happy 
I'm really happy to be at this stage of things now. It's taken a while of building up, but I feel like it's, it's really nice. Okay, so we're at the South Pier. We've got a few tourists, look. The tourists are here. Fabulous. Let's have a look. Manage your boat here. Every island will have a pier like this. Talk to the captain to buy a boat. There's actually quite a few boats and that was a, like a big old tourist boat. Okay, so there's a new journal entry apparently. Trader in town, town events. I sell boats. At the journal. My first ever boat is awesome. <laughs> Look at my boat. My boat is amazing. So it has 30 fuel. So I could go to many of the other little islands around here and go and check them out and see what they're like. Um, once I've done that, I'll probably need to come back and have a bit of a... Let's see. 12 fuel. 15 fuel. 20 fuel. 10 fuel. 40 fuel. 45. Well, that one looks like it's the, the least. So, I can repair the boat. I can refuel the boat. I can go on a journey. Boar Mountain. So, we're going to probably find some boars to kill here. I don't know like there's anything particular here. Alright. Whoa! <laughs> rah, 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 rah. Fur, treasure map, facts. Okay, nice. There's hardwood trees, there's coconuts. Besides are these guys. Apparently I now one shot. Well, that's nice. Sword's pretty good, isn't it? <laughs> Any other good stuff around here? Great, I get loads of stuff off them. Oh no, there's a golden treasure chest here. Okay, well, I need to remember that that's there. I'm terrible at remembering treasure ke treasure chest keys. Oh gosh, like loads of them. <laughs> I nearly died. I need to wait for my health to come up a little bit. If it's gonna. I do need to eat and drink as well, so let's uh, have a food. Let's have a water. I need a bit of a sleep as well, apparently, so. Uh, beehive pieces here. Oh, there's another boar. No, I don't want to deal with you at the moment. So I've got a bit of help left. Oh dear. No, I'm I'm not dealing with you right now, Mr. Troll. No chance. I know that all the really good stuff has troll leather. So I need to come back here with two golden keys. Chop some of the harder trees though. Those are pretty limited on my island. Yeah, I'm getting a little bit sleepy, which is uh, making me a bit out of breath. But I did, I just wanted to go on my boat. I wanted to just check it out. Check out the, the new islands and everything. But I'm going to have to go back, I think. But we did get some, um, like, boar fur. 
can be used in many ways, especially when crafting furniture, but it's worth like 350 just for the boar fur, 180's worth of like shells and crab claws, a whole load of fat and hardwood that uh, I wouldn't have gotten otherwise. But yeah, I think I do need to just head back home. I'm too tired. There's one more boar here to get as well. There's also bees. I don't know. Don't mess with bees. No, don't mess with bees, apparently. You get poisoned. That's not ideal. So I'm going to head back to the pier and head back to my boat. So this one is called Boar Mountains. But now we know. Pretty easy island. There's one troll on it. Which would be kind of good for, like, once I get a little bit more leather and I gear myself up a tiny bit. Get myself a slightly better sword, maybe. I think that will be the, the time then to, uh, to take on that troll. But it's amazing the difference that the sword made in how quickly I can kill a crab compared to the machete, for example. Yeah, I am so tired. Take me home, I'm so tired. So eventually what will happen, I imagine, is... I don't know whether... Going back home takes any fuel. No, it doesn't. So I can go to anywhere up to 30 fuel. So the ones that are like 40 fuel, I will probably need like an extra... So probably all these ones I can go to, these five. And these over here will probably need the, the iron boat. And these over here will probably need the like luxury boat or something along those lines. Ish. So I can go back there as many times as I want as long as I make the fuel for it. I'll have to slow boat it back though. I'm a little bit tired. Just a bit. But I'm really pleased with that. Like, um, it's definitely going to be some good money making going on with uh, the... The bits and pieces, but I do need to. T I need to take keys. Oh, I can't even get those cherries. Ah. There are also two, I think. One up to the north of town, and one somewhere on the beach, that need gold keys as well. So, we need to get those open. They'll probably have awesome stuff inside because the normal chests had pretty good stuff inside. I just need to make sure the keys are on me all, uh, at all times, and I've got a few of them. But there we are! So we are back to the snug, where I can build. Back to my little calf. It's so cute! And my chickens, and all of that stuff. And, um... I'm just gonna take a full 9 hour sleep, because we're at like the 43 minute mark in the in the episode, so may as well. So I hope you enjoyed, if you did then please do leave me a like below, if you'd like to see me do a bit more, we're gonna go to some more different islands, we'll probably take on the troll, I'm going to look after the cow until it produces leather, and then hopefully it will uh, allow me to gear up a bit more, and then when we go to these different islands I can sort of fight a bit better. Uh, all good plans for the future. So I hope you enjoyed. If you did, then please do leave me a like below. If you'd like to see more, please subscribe. I'll let you know when the videos are out. I hope to see you next time. In the meantime, please look after yourselves and keep being awesome.